Well, I tell you what, I took this boat out for a little run earlier, and I was amazed that two tubes could give me the performance that I got out of this. We, we got 44 miles an hour. What's going on down there? Uh, it's what we have, what we call the RPTs, and uh, revolutionary planing technology. And for lack of a better term, it's two hole bottoms on each tube. And you get added lift, added speed out of the two tubes, and it'll compete with any three tube log with the same horsepower, hands down. Well, it was fantastic. And I love the bow section up here too. Um, this this is probably the longest couch I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, it makes for a nice extended extended cushion on the on the starboard side. Even big tall guys can have a place to stretch out on that on that cushion. It it's really nice. NBA guy would have no problem with this one yeah, for sure. Even Shaq could get on that one. <laughs> And, uh, you know, the little touches mean a lot, like uh, having a sturdy table. Uh, the one, most of them kind of wobble around a little bit, and, and uh, this is really well done. Exactly. It, it, it makes the bases that we have, they're bolted in. It's, it's a nice table base, and it really locks it in tight, so it's, it's nice and sturdy. Well, I know we have some exciting stuff back here. Let's take a look. Let's do it. Well, JR, this is a really nice wide walkthrough here, but is there something else going on? Yeah, I'm glad you asked. We got this nice changing room that's built in at the end of the furniture here. Actually folds up, and then it pops open again. Wow, that's where you have a nice, uh, nice changing room, but which actually comes out of the end of the couch, but you usually don't use that space for anything else. Fantastic. Well, it looks like you use every square inch of this boat. Exactly. Well. I really like the storage you guys have with that extended couch up front. Uh, show me how the storage works. Yeah, actually, all the couches have storage underneath, and you just lift it up, and you have storage compartments underneath, which are rotocast, of course, on, on everything, and they're drained, so you can uh, everything drains right out of them. Well, you, you, most people have a lot of junk, and they'll, they'll find a place for here, won't they? Yeah, exactly. You, there's no, uh, no furniture without storage in it, so we're using every inch of space we can. Well, this is really cool. You know, this is a pretty compact helm, but it's really well featured. Uh, show me what's going on here. Yeah, a couple of a couple of big things are the, are the large gauges. The ergonomics of this this layout is really nicely laid out. You have the two big gauges that have the on the speedometer side. We have the volts and the fuel built into it, so you don't you're not looking at a bunch of gauges. You're looking at one, which is kind of nice in, in in the way. The switches are laid out pretty nice. The key ignition and the uh, the shifter is right where you need it to be, so it's it's really well laid out. You got a nice uh, sun station, sunning pad back here, and uh, you got your boarding ladder. It's just very well laid out. Yeah, a lot of space, a lot of lot of extra space. Again with the again with the space, nice shock absorber, so you you have storage down where your battery goes, and it comes up real nice, and it holds it up there when you're trying to work on your battery. Well, that's great. Thanks for showing me around, chair. No problem. I appreciate it. We just finished testing the Sylvan 8522 Sport. It's powered by Yamaha's F150 four-stroke. And the thing that makes the Sylvan a little different is it has uh, only two tubes, but they're uh, what they call RPT tubes, which are performance tubes. They're all shaped like uh, many boat hulls. So it really gives us a nice running surface. They got us on plane in 2.5 seconds, a zero to 30 time of 8.2 seconds and a really outstanding top speed of 43 miles an hour. Typically you only see speeds like that on three pontoon models. For more information on the Sylvan 8522 Sport and other great models, go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones and we'll see you out on the water. Say for 150 horsepower, this baby rocks.